Hey guys, this is Soumya from Bookfeast channel. Today I am going to review on the topic Zigzag which is written by Asha Nehemiah. And when you talk about the writer, she was born in 1958. She belongs to Chennai and also she is very much interested and passionate towards writing and teaching. And she says that if she had not been a writer, definitely she would have been a teacher. And her works will be filled with humor, fantasy, mystery and adventure and also the strong elements. So before getting into today's video, I just want to tell you that I have posted the particular content in Tamil also. So please do refer the description for the link. Please like, share, comment and subscribe our channel to get further more updates. We'll go with the characters. So when you talk about the first character, it is Dr. Somu. He is uh, living to Alaska and he is the owner of the uh, zigzag and uh, it has been gifted to him by a particular person. And also Dr. Krishnan, he is the uh, he leads the ownership card for the zigzag towards the end of the story. And Mrs. Krishnan, his wife, they had uh, they have uh, two children. They are titled Maya, who is nine year old daughter, and also Maya's elder brother Aravind. And their housemaid Lakshmi, and also the cook Visu, and the main character who seems to give a different plot, a twist in the plot, is none other than Mrs. Jijiwala. And uh, when you talk about the bird, it is a talking bird which can talk about uh, nearly 21 languages which is good in French poetry. And uh, the full name of the bird is Ziggy Zagu King of the Tonga. So apart from these characters, we also have hidden characters that is African witch doctor who gifted the zigzag to Dr. Somu because he had saved the life of the African witch doctor's son. So the story moves on like Dr. Uh, Ashok T. Krishnan clinic usually sounded more like an ancient Chinese torture chamber than a child specialist clinic. So Dr. Krishnan is running a child uh, specialist clinic and the sound, when it gets many sounds, when there is a noise, it seems like Chinese torture chamber. Because it's to, uh, children, they often keep on shouting and they keep on blambering and talking about something. So this creates a noise there and at that point Dr. Somo he starts writing a question whether he would like to have zigzag with him. He says no. Dr. Krishnan he says no but it was uh, felt that uh, felt by Dr. Somo that he was answered in affirmative where he says yes. So it was given to him. When he takes it to home there was a lot of cares about the bird that is their uh, children they started telling that it is none other than the beetle which is called a spitfire and then it goes to the point that it is a Somo uncle's pet that is Dr. Somo's pet and it must be a snake and it must be an African side winder. So it comes up with lots and lots of topic. This gave an irritation to Mrs. Krishnan because the appearance of the bird is not so lovely and pleasant. It looks in a very terrific manner and she was... Uh, like she was like also very disappointed at the same time she was very fearful she doesn't know how to react so she says that don't ever say that uh, the treasure it will it is like a treasure because whenever dr somo he gives something the children they often state that it is an absolute treasure or it must be a something which is highly in manner which is very worthy so she says he answer that it is not really worthy or it is not really precious because last time he had bought a plant eat a plant that eats insect and uh, it was said that it can uh, eat all the mosquitoes and they can be mosquito free but for that they have to invest, they have to get a room heater which is expensive. So this creates a chaos, both starts a conversation. On the other hand, the bird, it never spoke to them. So in order to divert the bird's attention, they bought many food for him like nuts and uh, fresh juicy fruits. It started storing everything in the uh, fans, in the fan and it started say, uh, staying at the top of the cot. When it keeps on moving, it doesn't react anything. It was uh, very weakly. It was very lazily started sleeping often. And the sound produced by the bird was very terrific, which made even the neighbors to make a call and ask what the sound is about. At certain point, the upstate people who live in the upstate made a call to Mrs. Krishnan and they stated asked her to sing slowly. 
as i cannot tolerate it this gave a great tension to mrs krishnan and she wanted to take the bird away she wanted not to give place for the bird in a home and when a mail was sent to dr somo he was uh, like questioning many states i have never heard zigzag snore in fact zigzag hardly sleeps love somo if you are finding it difficult ask my cook wish you to keep zigzag so if you unless you find it uh, easy please return it back to my cook wish you so this created a lot of confusion again where they uh, where can they go and find for the cook at the one or the other point they started uh, trying many ways in order to wake the bird they started uh, creating many ways like uh, they started uh, coyote to shout and hungry hyenas to shout and ferocious dog to shout but this never woke the bird it was literally sleeping and it was giving us noise sound which irritates soon by soon even the children they started uh, saying that it would be very nice to go to school than to stay in home finally they i have told you already finally they have sent a mail on day 1 and up to day 6 it was like a terrific day of their life where they wait for the mail at the same time they were uh, continuously hearing the harmonic cacophony sound produced by the bird so it keeps on giving this sound on the 7th day they received the mail and they came to know that they have to handle it over to their cook so they have no other option finally mr krishnan he states that he'll be taking the bird to his clinic when he took it to his clinic it uh, started speaking to the people where it started uh, singing song for the children french like french poetry it started telling french stories and started even representing the children so there he came to know that it was the bird which was uh, trained in order to represent when it is kept idly in home it never allowed to be that's the reason for its sleeping and in before that there was also an incident the bird it started i have told you na the bird it started storing everything on the top of the fan when the switch was on by the servant lakshmi all the seeds nuts flowers especially papaya everything it was flying to the floor and it dashed all over the places and one such papaya it dashed to the art of the mrs krishnan this gave her a very angry mood and she started having an hatredness towards the bird and finally it was taken to the clinic it started representing people then the uh, mrs krishnan he was literally sorry for the bird because he had no other option he had uh, no other option to keep it in home so finally he receives a call where his wife she was very fabulously happy and she was speaking with a smile she says that please don't send the bird i would like to keep it for a trial once again maybe it's my fault because I have told you now the most uh, twisting character of the main plot seems to be Mrs. Jijuwala and she was where when the exhibition started she started uh, having a glance all over the artistic work and finally she chose the work that uh, uh, which was wasted by the bird that is it is actually a scenery which uh, depicts the Marina Beach scenery with the sun so it was literally collapsed by the papaya and it was literally done not by the bird but by the mistake and work of La- lakshmi when she on the fan everything flies over and it splashed over the place and she says it was bought by uh, mrs jijwala for 5000 rupees and it was very immense pleasure for her to welcome the bird again home so finally it was everything with the family which was very much worried to keep the bird now they enjoyably take it into account of their in charge so the bird it never showed any reaction at its place instead it accepted the toffee and the uh, paper wrapper which was given to it in order to say in affirmative that it is happy to stay with them so mr krishnan he assures that he used uh, he must make it uh, happen that you should have uh, taken it to the clinic because it maintains and represent people and it keeps the uh, chinese torture center to be a pleasant full silent clinic so here i conclude my video once again i tell you that i have posted the particular content in tamil also if you are need of that please do watch it please do like share comment and subscribe my channel to get further more updates thank you